Hi everyone, it's Forsythia with Cacti on White and welcome to my channel. I thought I'd pop on and give you guys a quick video. Um, I wanted to share with you a recent acquisition. That I have in my collection this is the Australian bottle tree and I've wanted one of these for a while. I really wanted to have it as a bonsai. So I found one for, for a good price, I think. Um, obviously it's quite young, um, but I wanted to share it with you guys. So this is a, again, an Australian bottle tree the scientific name I will put down below because I'm sure I will, I will butcher it, but it's Brachychiton rupestris is the scientific name. And these are native to Australia. So um, they, they come from Queensland, I know, and other areas within Australia. And it's a very um, popular tree in Australia. It is used, uh, you know, we use it or ornamentally here. It's um, in the U.S. primarily. It, it can be, obviously it's a tree, so in landscape. Um, and I know in Australia from my reading, they have used this tree to make baskets and ropes and other, other types of uh, home uh, utilitarian items. Uh, but again, for me, this is going to be a uh, ornamental uh, tree specifically I'm going to bonsai this tree so it will you can see here it's the, the trunk is super thin um, I've had it about two weeks and it's doing well I'm going to keep it indoors you can keep these indoors um, it's doing well these, this light green you see here, this is all new growth in the last two to three weeks. So it looks to be liking the conditions. It sits on a very sunny window. Um, so I'll, that is a good segue into care information about the um, Australian bottle tree. So they do like full sun. They need to be planted in you know, fast draining soil um, they like indoors, when you keep these indoors, they like a good watering. They need to be, they'll grow faster and better um, with good watering. Um, but it does, again, need to be in fast draining soil, which this one is. And this um, planter is quite nice. I forget where I got it from. But the bottom part of this is a drainage for drainage. So. Um, the water is, is catching in that. But uh, more about the care. Fast draining soil, I mentioned that full sun, regular watering indoors. Um, it's hardy if outdoors in your landscape, it's hardy up to uh, 18 to 20 degrees Fahrenheit. So yeah, it's super cool. When the trunk gets a little thicker, I'm going to start uh, trying to train it into a bonsai form, but that's gonna be a little bit. So it is growing quite fast though. It's, so let's hope this trunk starts to um, get a little thicker here. I think it's gonna be super cute. I'll put some pictures of it uh, that I'll just get from the internet of it in a bonsai form. So yeah, just wanted to share this beauty with you guys my new Australian bottle tree. If you have this plant or tree, I should say, in your collection, drop a comment down below and let me know about yours, how it's doing. I'd love to see pictures if you have that of your Australian bottle tree. But yeah, the leaves are super nice. You can see here, light. I love the shape of the leaf. Really, really cute there. So yeah. Let me know if you have one, how it's doing, any tips or tricks. I highly appreciate it. So very, very quick video today. I hope you guys are doing well. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't done so already, 
consider subscribing to the channel. I don't say this often, but it really, really helps me out. Don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you know when I upload new content. I hope you guys are having a great day, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.